Hi, my name is Jeff Johnston, Lead Communications Economist for CoBank. Over the last few weeks, the coronavirus pandemic has shown the importance of having a reliable broadband connection. And unfortunately for many of those living in rural America, they are experiencing the harsh realities of the digital divide like never before. Broadband operators are seeing a 20 to 40% increase in data traffic where a stay-at-home order has been issued. This is putting undue stress on rural communication networks and some are struggling to keep up. For example, rural networks that are designed to support 25 megabits per second are operating as low as seven megabits per second. This makes using video applications such as Zoom or FaceTime near impossible. To keep those who have broadband access connected, a number of rural operators have signed the FCC's Keep America Connected pledge. This includes agreeing not to cancel service or charge late fees for those who can't pay because of the coronavirus. It also includes opening up Wi-Fi hotspots to any American who needs them. The FCC has also given wireless internet service providers who typically operate in rural America access to additional spectrum, which enables them to increase network capacity. For those in rural America who do not have broadband access, the situation is dire and it's forcing cities to get creative. For example, education officials in South Carolina are sending out hundreds of school buses equipped as Wi-Fi hotspots to rural and low income areas. People can drive near or walk up to the bus to get connected. Desperate times calls for desperate measures, and we are encouraged to see how those living in rural America are banding together to get through these very challenging times.